Hello everyone, thank you for joining us today. We're excited to share information with you about the things going on here at Sears Holdings Company. It's not advancing. Just one moment. What we want what we want to do is not only talk about Sears Marketplace, but we want to share information information with you regarding Sears Holdings. We think it's important for you to know a little bit about us and our heritage and, and our, our sheer size out here in the marketplace. We want to talk about how we value partnership, how you can advertise with us, because I know it's very important from a seller perspective to be able to get the word out about the merchandise that you're selling. And lots of tips about how to be successful, information about Fulfilled by Sears, and then the last slide is how to contact information so that you can follow up with us as appropriate. And we will allow for questions um, at the end of the production. You can also um, submit a question in advance. Sears has been a retailer here in the United States for over 100 years. We operate under the Sears banner as well as the Kmart banner, and we have websites and mobile sites for both. One of the interesting things that we offer is we do have an in-store kiosk system. When one of our members goes to the kiosk in a store, they do have the ability to, to access our entire assortment. Not only what's in the store, not only what's listed as a, a Sears or Kmart.com item, but all of our marketplace seller items are also able to be accessed um, through those kiosks. We have approximately 1,100 locations throughout both formats, and we carry over 30,000 brands. Signature brands that we have are Kenmore, Craftsman, and Die Hard, and then we're proud to carry many other brands that are available out there in the marketplace um, through our sites and in our stores. From a sheer size perspective or organization, um, as a historic retailer here, we our mall presence is very important. You can see that we are in 59 of the top 144 malls in the country. We also have access to plenty of financing. I mentioned our store size. We carry about $5 billion worth of physical inventory. And we've been working hard at keeping our expenses down so that we are a profitable organization. The Shop Your Way member platform is a very important piece of our organization, how we go to market. Our Shop Your Way members are our most valuable members. We encourage everyone who shops us to become a member, and they all have options to do that um, at the checkout on the website, for example. Current members, we ask them to sign in so that we can make sure that we're presenting them with the most appropriate offers. Our member base are our most active shoppers. We've had over 50 million of our members have shopped with us in the last 12 months. And they, when they shop, they earn points. And then they come back and they redeem those points. For us, that generates very large percentages of our sales. And also, ShopAway members spend more on each visit. One, they spend more because they're getting more rewards. Two, they spend more because we're a premium shopping experience for them. And by putting points into the market for them, we're incentivizing them to come shop. I'm going to turn it over to Joseph to talk about partnership with Marketplace. Okay, really quick before I start talking out um, about partnership here, I want to send a, a quick uh, do a launch a quick poll. Interested in finding out are you currently with our Marketplace or not? So if you go ahead and take a moment and Check your screen and answer. It will give us an idea who we're talking to today. So thank you. We're collecting poll data right now. This data is important to us because it will especially help us um, skew our presentation as we know with what the status of most of you are. It will also help us prepare ourselves for the types of questions that you may be asking throughout and at the end of the presentation. Okay. Thank you for that. That, that is helpful. So a little bit about partnership with the Sears Marketplace. 
we have multiple lever, lever sorry, <laughs> I fumbling in the mouth today. I, we have multiple ways to connect with us. I mean, we're a very dynamic platform. We connect with and, and partner with advertising. We have great tools. We work with you for competitive rates. We have that integration. We have value. We have the deals. And so all these elements, and we'll talk about a little bit more of them later in the webinar about what really tr makes a true part a good partnership from a seller and us and how we can help you move forward. One of the most common questions that we get from our sellers and from um, sellers considering joining our marketplace is once my items are listed on the site, how can they how can I get more exposure for them? So we're excited to share with you a couple of ways that our sellers choose to engage with us to get more exposure. We partner directly with Critio for sponsor product advertising. Some of you may be familiar with their network that's available um, on a number of publisher sites. Our sellers have the option of leveraging sponsored products through um, the network or they can do them um, as a private market where they can secure advertising specifically on SearsandKmart.com. For us, that's very important. It allows you to get um, top page placement for your products um, on a select SKU basis, and it allows you to kind of control when, when you want things highlighted out there in the marketplace for us. These ads show up um, from a search and a browse perspective. We also have carousels in a, a number of places across the site. Two key things regarding sponsor product advertising is it's a cost per click program um, with, a, with a great portal. So the seller is able to control their account. Our sellers choose how much they want to budget against their account. They choose the SKUs they want to promote, the maximum they'll spend per, per click. Um, they can, you can pay your investment over a period of time so that, um, that you can monitor your spending. There's also excellent reporting. That reporting will, will show you ev everything. It'll show you how many impressions were served, it'll show you how many clicks, it'll show you the average cost per click that you were charged, it'll show you resulting sales. Um, we have an offline online attribution aspect as well for that. So our sellers are usually very happy with this platform because it does give, it moves them to the top, especially from a search perspective, and it gives them an opportunity to talk about themselves and show off the fine products that we do have. Um, there will be a couple of links in the deck when you receive it. You can use those to um, educate yourself more and watch the tutorials about how to set up your account. We have other advertising um, opportunities where we as an organization are promoting marketplace. So for example, we are including marketplace brands in emails. Our emails go out to millions and millions of members every week. This little snippet that says Explore Sears Marketplace is just one, one excerpt of how we incorporate um, marketplace messaging into a number of our emails. We have a deal of the day email that goes out that features a number of sellers who choose to participate in that program also, um, for example. Marketplace items are included in the homepage events. So for example, um, if you go to the Sears.com homepage today, about in the middle of the page, you're going to see a section that says Shop Your Way Membership Brings You More. And in that section, there's three things that are highlighted from marketplace sellers. There's our fitness assortment, um, there's a jewelry feature, and then Wilson's Leather um, is sponsoring a special offer, and so they're named in there as Wilson's Leather. So that's always exciting when sellers realize, hey, we are getting nice placement on our site, we're getting top billing. Obviously, it's a big week this week since it's President's Day, and we're very happy to feature Marketplace as a, a key part of our business on our website. Now, we have lots of tips about how you can become a more successful seller. That's Joseph's areas of expertise, so I'm going to hand it back over to him. Thanks, Kim. So for those of you that have, are on our marketplace, this is extremely important information. For those of you that are not yet, it's still pertinent because it gives you an idea of what the information, what, how we do things, and what we're expecting from sellers. So really to create, uh, start with a positive partnership with us, we, it, it really starts with you providing quality content because A-plus content helps customers, as we call them members, look and find and understand and feel the product online, uh, making sure they're proper, properly categorized, 
making sure your return policy is in sync with the Sears policy because they're shopping on Sears.com. They are expecting to have Sears policies. And so we require at least a minimum the same when it comes to return policies. We expect sellers to ship on time. We expect sellers not to cancel orders because doing those makes a bad member experience. To help a conversion, we, um, we'll talk more in detail about all these things a little more, but we're, we're expecting that the products to be in stock, not to list out of stock products. To, we'll talk about high-low pricing a little bit. We'll talk about order prep time and free shipping. And we're going to talk about a little bit about how to promote awareness within the marketplace as well. So A-plus content. Uh, we require val uh, valid UPCs in majority of our product categories now. And so once you start building your items, it's important to have that valid UPC because I know personally when I get a UPC, if I go into Walmart, Target, one of those other competitors, and I look for something online on, on Sears, I'm going to take that UPC and go on Sears and f look for it by UPC. And if you have a product listed without a UPC, you're going to miss out on my search because you didn't have your UPC in there. So that's extremely important. Um, so product titles, one of the things that we do, we, we already, and well, one of the attributes we asked for was we asked for brand. We don't want product type brands to be in the product title because then you're going to end up with something like this where it says incorrect, Cargo X, Cargo X, Sport 20. It just makes, it, makes us look a little silly. But that's driven on the content that sellers are providing us. Um, with product descriptions, you want to give us best product descriptions. If you go to a website and see a good portion of product descriptions where you've got dimensions and attributes and explanations of what the product is com or compare it to another listing that has the title and really nothing as a description, the, the listing with nothing is not going to get sales because it doesn't help drive a member's confidence that they really know what they're getting. That goes the same with the rest of the item attributes and quality of the other product data that's provided to us. One of the things that we use with item attributes is if you go to Sears.com or Kmart.com and you look at, look at our nav, navigation on the left once you start searching, you notice you can filter down on products. And if you don't have those important attributes or other attributes, all of a sudden as a member filters, your product disappears out of that filter and you, you won't get those converted sales. Weight and, weight, getting accurate weight and dimensions are important as well because we use that to calculate shipping on the website. Images. Um, I can't remember the last time I bought an item and ha I bought something with not a very good image or only one image. I look for multiple images, looking at all different angles of images. Um, I want to be able to see and understand what that product is on the site with more than one image, and that's going to help that conversion rate. Additionally, categorization. Uh, it's one of those things that you want to make sure you're categorized right. Because when you categorize right, if you're br if a, if somebody's browsing by cate by the category, you're going to be included that. But if you happen to put a dog bed in the mattresses, it's going to look a little weird when you go browsing mattresses and you see a dog bed. But if I'm looking for a dog bed and I go through dog beds, I'm not going to find your product. So it's making sure that you get that correct categorization. And I, and I already mentioned attributes a little bit there. So we see things that are, if you're in seller portal itself, we have things that are important and we have things that are required. The important, while they're not required, are going to help drive those filtering of results and give you better search results and hopefully get you more conversion rates when people are looking at your product. One of the key things we, we, we want to emphasize, and this is one of the most important things probably I'm going to say today, um, high-low pricing. Our website functions, so when you list a standard selling price, it has a standard price in black on the website. But if you put an item on sale, that high price is, has a strike through and your sale price is there in red and it says percentage off of whatever that percentage sa sa savings. People in our today's economy are trained to only buy products that are on sale. 
as as much as you might think you well I have the best price out there it, it might be one of those emotional feeling type things that it's not on sale I can't buy it I'll wait till it's on sale when really you may actually have it on sale but you're not utilizing the sale price functionality so it's an emotional psychological thing that you need to help that member understand yeah you really are getting a good deal on this because normally it's fifty dollars but I'm selling it at forty right now so going on to operational excellence when we're talking operational excellence making sure that with the logistics everything behind the scenes is functioning correctly uh, one of the key things and we review this when it, when sellers on board but is that return policy making sure it's parity to Sears. Sears in, in general has a 30-day return policy. So if you come to our site and say, well, I have a 15-day policy, we're not going to, that's not parity to our policy and it's going to cause problems with our members. And we're going to come back at, at you and ask you to change that to have parity to us. But on the other hand, if you wanted a 45-day policy, that's actually a better policy than most Sears categories and, and that's giving the members a better experience. It's critical to make sure you have accurate tracking numbers once the item's shipped out and, and marking it shipped in the seller portal as soon as you have that tracking number and have it out the door. You don't want to get into a situation where the member was promised it was going to ship. It actually ships and two days later you finally get around to the, the to seller portal and putting it in seller portal because that member is most likely is going to contact you and say, hey, where's my product? Now it just had an extra touch point that's not needed. So make sure you get the tracking numbers in there. Make sure your tracking numbers are accurate and 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 valid that the member will actually be able to track by themselves. Key point here, manage inventory levels to avoid out of stock. Make sure when you're getting low, especially if you're using a shared inventory across multiple marketplaces, when you're getting low, mark Mark your items out of stock on, on the site so you don't oversell. That's the last thing you want to do. Uh, when you have something that's out of stock, it's a bad member experience. They will never buy from you, but mainly they might never buy from Sears as well because they're counting on Sears to have that product in stock when we say it's in, in product. And so the key there, don't cancel orders unless the member reaches out to you directly and asks you to cancel it or, or the Sears fraud team comes back and asks you to cancel an order that we found to be, to be fraudulent. When a member does reach out to you via, via phone or via email, it's imperative that you get back to them within one business day. Uh, sooner the better. Uh, man, your, make sure you have a customer service phone number that's picked up. doesn't just go to voicemail because people are old school still. They still pick up that phone. They want to talk to somebody when there's something wrong. If they call our call center, we're just going to tell them to contact you because we don't have the answers. Then one other thing about operational excellence here is that order prep time. The faster that you can process your order, the more conversions you can have. If you go out there and say, it takes me a week to process orders, well, we take that week and we add the transit time and members look at that availability and they just go somewhere else. But if you can actually, if you're actually, you can ship within one or two business days, that's pretty much standard around the board for majority of online experiences and so you're going to keep those conversions coming when you can actually order and process those orders quickly and be honest with your prep time really don't say you can ship it in one day and ship it in three because that's going to end up being a late shipment or don't say it's going to take you five days because you're afraid of getting a late shipment when typically it takes you two make sure you have that balance correctly and it's going to help help that balance of conversion help the balance of on-time shipping and create a member a, a great experience across the board. An important thing as well, uh, people are expecting more and more and more online to get free or minimally charged flat rate for shipping. People just don't want to pay for shipping. Even though shipping plus your item cost might be cheaper, a lot of people, it's, it's again, it's just a psychological thing. Do your best to have every item as possible to be marked as free shipping. There's more effort. There's a lot of uh, several different ways how to mark things free shipping on our site. Um, you can use our create a zero dollar flat rate. You can create a deal for for free shipping. You can also put shipping overrides at zero dollars on the item. There's 
our FAQ gives more information. We have a really good, a decent FAQ about all the different ways you can mark things as free shipping. And if you're not 100% sure, you can always reach out to our solar support team and they can help you with it. One thing here, this promotions manager, it's, it's a great tool. Um, we've spent a lot of hard work building out our promotions manager. So one of the biggest things is when Sears has a deal, like I have some logos here that say 50 Sears days or friends and family, you can actually opt in and join the site-wide event. And so your products would have the same promotions. You don't have to go and do your sale prices for those items. You go under the deals promotion tool, you opt into the products, make sure you have inventory, and you're, you benefit from having a Sears advertised sale and you being part of it. But when you're not having a Sears promotions, you can also go in there. You can mark your own prom promotions. You can do buy one, get one deals. You can do all sorts of fun, fun stuff. And, and then functional stuff. And then we also offer a deal heist, which is kind of like those hot items. You can submit to the deal heist and be part of deal heist if, as you work with the, with their or with our deals team. There's a couple URLs to help you out. When you get the deck, you can go out and check those things out. So another piece, if you if you struggle at fulfillment, we we do have a fulfillment service. We call it Fulfill by Sears. Uh, fulfilled by Sears is we use the Sears logistics network to fulfill. You come in, you you send us a pallet of goods or two pallets of goods, a truckload of goods, whatever it is, and you, the products will be listed on Sears.com, but you can also use it for your other orders as well. You can use it for eBay orders, Walmart orders, whatever, and it will we'll do the fulfilling for you. It's a pay-as-you-go pay model. It's very convenient. It's quick. It's fast. Um, we sh typically ship the same day when we use the Fulfill by Sears stuff. So it's that got reliability, it's quickness, and it's going to be cost savings. I uh, hear as they look at other fulfillment services out there, our rates are actually lower than some of the competition. So it's definitely worth checking out if you use a fulfillment service to check out Fulfill by Sears. So I'm going to pass this back to Kim, and she'll keep going with more information. So as you can see the question of this slide, these are just some of the the large um, sellers that we have out there on our marketplace that our members are, are purchasing things from every day. One of these sellers I bought a Christmas gift from, for example, for my son because it happened to be a, a, a subcategory that, that we didn't carry. And I was very grateful that I was able to do that. So. Us having you in our portfolio is, is very important to us and to our members. It also helps you as business people because it gives you a, a large platform that's getting, you know, hundreds of thousands of eyeballs every day to our sites so that you can hopefully sell more merchandise as well. We'd really love to be able to see your, your brands on some of these slides in the future. This last slide is information about how to reach us. Clearly, we have a general inbox that you can send questions to us, or, or um, we can work through any of those, as well as you can work directly with Channel Sale and their staff. Um, we'd like to open it up now for questions. So anyone who has questions, you know, um, please submit those so that we can cover those or, or ask them now. Perfect. Thanks so much, Kim and Joseph. Okay, and uh, mostly most of the questions were answered by Joseph, but let's see if we can get someone online. Let me see, we have Sudhir. So let me unmute Sudhir. Hey, Sudhir. Yeah, actually, uh, I wanted to know about what kind of a annual sale is, uh, happening on Sears.com, uh, uh, but uh, I think there is some reservation in providing that information. So I wanted to, you know, understand how vibrant is this sales channel in comparison to other in the market. Yeah, Sears.com numbers we don't release publicly. We just, it's a policy within, within, the, within the organization. We only release the organization as a whole. And so they are public out there. You can go check our SEC filings or our annual report, and you can see Sears as a whole 
They could find Sears Kmart and Sears.com and Kmart.com, Shop Your Way Sales, My Go For Sales, and any other way we have it. But it's just not something we're allowed to, to release publicly, unfortunately. Well, that's fine. Okay. Thanks, Sudhir. And uh, we also had Tain who had a question, and I believe, Joseph, you answered the same. So most of the sellers out here, they reach out to uh, Marketplace Sales at SearsHC.com, correct? Yes, that's correct. Perfect. Uh, we also have another question out here. So, uh, Joseph, since you were mentioning about fulfilled by Sears, uh, do you have the figures on how much does Sears charge for merchants? If you go to SearsCommerceServices.com and check out FBS, I believe there's a rate card there. Okay, perfect, perfect. We'll make a note of that. And another question that uh, we have out here is, what kind of deals can be created on Sears platform. So let me check out the FAQ to make sure I'm speaking correctly. Because on the FAQ page, we do have a list of everything, the optional, what type of deals. And that's one of the ones I have in the deck that people will be able to see. So I'm looking at, we can do simple deals with fixed prices. We can do simple deals with percentages up, simple deals with dollar up, bonus deals. So buy one, get, buy X and get Y free. So example, buy one shirt, get 50% off another. Um, we can do coupons. And then we can, let's see, we also, and we talked about this too. There are, are certain times that we can do shop your way um, promotions and stuff like that. Um, so there's pretty much the standard ways that you can do deals. We've got it. We also have a page on our website, a deal section, and when you're in the header of Sears.com, you can see deals at the top left. You can click on that anytime as a seller, just to get a view, or as a, a member shopper, and you can see all of the, the special deals that we have. Many of those are marketplace sellers supported, um, as well as regular offers that we have from our vendor direct and brands that we, we carry on our own here at Sears. So our value-seeking members know about that section. They go check it out all the time. Um, and I also mentioned that we do have certain emails that go out to highlight deals to people who opt in for those. So it's a robust program. Thank you so much, uh, Joseph and Kim. I have uh, a case who would like to ask a question. Over to you, Kim. Hey, thanks very much. It's been a great uh, presentation. I just have a quick question. Is channel sale configured to be able to communicate with Sears right now? Oh, yes, absolutely. We have uh, a complete integration when it comes to Sears, not only managing your products, um, inventory, but even your orders as well and optimizations. Okay. So and then we'll reach out to you. Okay, that's great. And then the second part of that, if, if our inventory is changing, let's say every 20 minutes, can we continually push during the day to continually update Sears as to our inventory level? Absolutely. So out here on our platform, we have an auto scheduler that can be set on different intervals. Like, you know, you can have it on an hourly basis every three hours, six hours. And you also have an option, like, you know, if you change your inventory manually, you can come on a platform and like, you know, do a force push, like push it manually. Okay, that's great. I appreciate the answer. Again, fantastic, a great presentation, guys. Thanks, Case. So uh, anyone with any questions can send them right over or even raise your hands. Hey, one last question. Sure, Case, go ahead. Uh, do we get a comment? Uh, do we get a copy of this presentation? Uh, so what we would be doing is we would be sending this uh, to the Sears team first and post their approval. We'll uh, send out the links for the same. So that should be within like, you know, a week, week's time. All right, thanks again. Hey, most welcome case. And uh, let's see, I have 10 
has been here. So Tain, if you could like to ask your question once again. Oh, I'm good. Um, you guys answered my question completely. Thank you very much for your time, everybody. You're welcome. Hey, that's that's really great, thoughtful of you, Tain. Okay, so I believe that's it. And uh, thank you so much, Joseph, Kim, and Christy for your time today. And to every one of you guys, Okay, the feedback and the recorded version of this webinar will be available and we'll be sharing the details on how we would be circling the same. And uh, if you have any additional questions, what you could do is you could send us an email to info at channelsale.com and we'll try our level best to answer the same. Thank you guys once again and have a great day. Thank you.